Hey friends, it's Shane from HowToRinch.com and I'm going to share a funny little story here. Hopefully I can keep the speed uh, going here with the poor reception. But uh, last night I wanted to put a uh, reprogram a garage door opener and I have multiple doors here at How to Wrench, as you can see here. But check this out. So when I programmed the remote, I wanted this top one to be the top garage, which it worked last night when I checked it. And then this bottom one was going to be my, my second garage. Watch what happens here. So go ahead here and get a good shot. Garage door is shutting, right? Just push the button once, and that one's opening. <laughs> so these Genie uh, remotes here must have one heck of a signal on there for the remote learn code. So when I did the first garage, it, it worked fine. And then when I did the second one, it was actually catching the, the code for both of them there. And now both buttons are programmed into this this one uh one door opener here so i'm probably gonna have to unplug one door so that it isn't trying to learn the new code uh, i think that's pretty dang funny though but it's the the whole point of the story here is that's why you gotta check your work uh if you don't and you just tighten a bolt or walk away from something you take that risk of having that failure because you just didn't double check your work so i'm getting ready to head to work i'm gonna have to manually close these and uh now that i know of a problem uh i gotta fix it so make it a great day keep wrenching and stay tuned to howtowrench.com